The life stream is the essence of the planet. A churning river of memories. As they come together and drift apart, a story is given shape. An unprecedented tale. Another possibility. Time to burn. Calling lightning. Say goodbye.
Get down here, Merc. <laughs> this way, Merc. I'll have this open in a sec. Keep an eye out, Wedge. You got it! The reactor's just up ahead. Time to earn your keep, rookie. Never thought we'd have a soldier on our side. It sure is something else, considering Shinra employs Soldier and we're Shinra's enemy. But he quit Shinra. He wasn't Soldier. Now, he's with us. Cloud, was it? I'm Biggs. And this here is... I'm not interested in names. Once this job's done, we're done. Right, uh, well, let's get to it then. Open Sesame. Our target is the reactor core. Y'all know the plan. Yep. Right. Roger that. Don't think I trust you just yet, Merc. Troll just up ahead. Couldn't make it easy for us, huh? Over there. Now's your chance to show me what you can do. Try to keep up. Stay down, asshole. Let's go. Yo, you've been in a reactor before, right? Sure. When I worked for Shinra. Yeah, I bet you were a real company man. People in this city depend on the Marco flowing through this planet. Every day using more and more. But they don't know what it is they really doing. Do you? They're bleeding the planet dry. Shinra would take every last drop of Marco from the planet if they could. And this pile of scrap they call a Marco reactor is what lets them. I'm not here for a lecture. Let's just do it. I'll secure our escape. Are we really going to blow this thing up? Sure is big. Getting the code to this door wasn't easy. It cost us. Cost us some good friends. It'll cost us much more than that if we let the reactor keep draining the life from the planet. Hey, you're awfully quiet. No opinion on the matter? Not really. Why should I care? What? Planet's dying, man! You telling me that doesn't move you? I just want to get this job done. 
No need to get involved further than that. All done! Nice work, Jesse. We almost there. This place, it ain't gonna be nothing more than a hunk of junk. Cloud, you set the bomb. Shouldn't you do it? Nope. I'm supervising to make sure we get our money's worth out of you. Besides, I gotta make sure you ain't a shinless spy. Go on. Whatever. Stand there! Hurry! Uh, yeah. Sorry. An alarm? Damn it! We've been made! Gah! Where are they? Where are they coming from? Up there! Give them all you got. Hope you don't mind if I fill you full of holes. There's no escape. He's never in doubt. All right, the timer's set. And that's our cue to get out of here. Come on. Shoot! Can't move! You all right? Cloud! My legs! It's stuck! My hero! We better hurry before the whole place blows. Where is everyone? They're okay, right? Yeah, they're okay. And we're back. Hurry up! We got one minute! Run! Faster! Over here, guys! Cloud and the members of Avalanche escape from the ruins of Reactor 1 and flee to Sector 8. To avoid the security forces, they split up, each taking their own route to the rendezvous point. A train headed to the Sector 7 slums, where their hideout awaits. Excuse me. Do you have any idea what's going on? Uh, well... Are those flowers? Don't see those around very often. Oh, these? You like them? They're only one go. Mm. Alright. I'll take one. Really? Thanks. Here you 
you are. Hope you like it. Nice meeting you. Mm. Huh. Looks real. You're that soldier we're looking for, aren't you? Security officers. Hey! Rabble! Damn it. That's as far as you go. There's no way out. Surrender. Guess I have no choice. Brace yourself. This ends here! <laughs> Nothing to it. <laughs> Gotta hurry. Aboard the last train, Cloud makes for Sector 7 to rendezvous with Avalanche at the bar called Seventh Heaven. It is here at their hideout in the slums that someone eagerly awaits Cloud's return. to be shy. Cloud's our friend. Don't worry about it. Looks like everything went well. You didn't fight with Barrett, did you? Fight, huh? Just a little. I should have known. Barrett's not the easiest to get along with, and you've been getting in fights since we were kids. I was worried you might. Is that a flower? I can't remember the last time I saw one in the slums. But... A flower for me? Oh, Cloud, you shouldn't have. Don't mention it. Here. Really? Thank you, Cloud. It smells wonderful. <laughs> Maybe I should fill the place with flowers. I'm back! Daddy, you're home! That's right, Angel, I am. I got something to ask you, Cloud. Was Soldier with those guys we fought at the reactor? No. I'm sure of it. Oh yeah? How could you be so sure? If Soldier was there, you guys wouldn't be alive to talk about it. And you know because you used to be one of them. Ain't that right? Enough, Barrett. <laughs> You're strong, I'll give you that. Maybe everyone in Soldier is.
But now you're a part of Avalanche, so you got no business praising Shinra. I was just answering your question. Is that all? I want to talk about my money. Hmm. <laughs> Meeting first. Downstairs, all of y'all. You, you right. got it. Yes, sir. Come on, Cloud. How about something to drink? Hmm. I'll take anything with a kick. Just a minute. I'll make one for you. You know, I'm relieved you made it back safely. What's with you all of a sudden? That job was nothing. I guess not. You were in Soldier after all. This meeting might be a long one. We have to start planning our next move. But don't worry, you'll get your money soon. Sure, once I do, I'll be on my way. Say, Cloud, are you feeling all right? Yeah, why? It's nothing. I just thought you might be a little tired, that's all. Not after a job like that. Right. Are you okay? You've been acting strange. Listen, Cloud. We need your help. Not that again. Listen, Tifa. The planet is in pain. At this rate, it'll die. Someone has to do something. Let Barrett and his buddies do something. It's got nothing to do with me. I'll come back tomorrow for that payment. I can't believe you! We grew up together, and you're just gonna walk right out? <sighs> you forgot the promise, too. Promise? So you really did forget. Try to remember, Cloud. It was seven years ago. We met by the water tower back home. Right. I thought you would never come, and I was getting a little cold. Sorry I'm late. So what's up? You said you had something to tell me? I'm leaving in the spring for Midgar. Should have figured. All the boys leave town. I'm not looking for a job like the rest of them. I'm gonna join Soldier and become the best. Just like Sephiroth. The great war hero, huh? Isn't it hard to join Soldier? I won't be back for a while. 
<laughs> what are you laughing at? Think I'll see you in the paper someday? Don't know. But I'll try. Hey! Let's make a promise. If you get real famous... Promise you'll come save me when I'm in a bind. What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. You want to be a hero, right? Come on, promise me! All right. I promise. Remember now? Well, I'm not famous. And I'm no hero. So I can't keep our promise. But didn't your dream come true? You joined Soldier. So you've got to keep your promise. All finished, Mr. Soldier. A promise is a promise. Here's your money. Is this all? Don't make me laugh. What do you say? You got another mission lined up? I'll do it for 3,000. Cloud? You make it sound like you're doing us a favor, you ungrateful little... All right, settle down. We need all the help we can get, don't we? <laughs> but the rest of the money's for Marlene's schooling. Two thousand. I'll take it. Thanks, Cloud. Don't get the wrong idea. This is just easier than looking for something else. <laughs> we leave for the next mission tomorrow morning. And I'll be coming with. Hey, Cloud. How about a drink? Don't need a rest up for tomorrow. <laughs> Can't sleep nerves, I guess. I'm hoping this will help. Okay. You kept your cool during that mission. What kind of training do soldiers go through to become like that? Nothing special. Yeah, right. Come on, tell me. Fine. Let me think. Okay, so basically you were born a tough guy. Doesn't help me in the least. You worried? Then hire me as your bodyguard. Whoa, you know I can't afford that, right? I got kids to feed. You do? How many? From babies to the not-so-young. I'd say at least 20. That many? Yeah, that many. <laughs> Man, thanks for the laugh. I feel more relaxed already. What'd I do? Eh, let's continue this conversation later, when we're celebrating the success of our next mission. Still hungry? Can't work on an empty stomach. We have an important mission tomorrow. I don't think that's gonna hold you over till then. You know what? You're right. I should pack a lunch. Hey, we're not going on a picnic. Yeah, I know. Um, Cloud, I have a favor. Can you come with me for a sec? Where are we going? 
to see candy. Here, Candy. Come on, girl. Let's get you home. Is that one of your cats? No. I found her on the way back from the reactor. Poor baby was trembling in shock. Probably from the blast. We were on a job, so I couldn't take her with us. I've been worried about her ever since. I'm glad she's okay. Thanks for coming with me. Now I can focus 100% on our mission tomorrow. We're counting on you. Yes, sir! Cloud, perfect timing. I need your help. What is it? Well, I wanted to collect data on the Sector 5 reactor. So I accessed the Shinra database. And their intrusion detection system locked you out. Exactly. I knew you would get it, Mr. X-Soldier. Of course. I programmed it so we can hack the security via a virtual battle. This is where you come in. You do this and I'll owe you a pizza. Don't worry about it. If it's for the mission, it's already included in my share. You don't really mean that, do you? Anyways, ready? Here goes! Way to go, Cloud! That was quick! It was nothing. I know you turned down the pizza, but I might have something better. I think you're gonna love this. Yeah? I was searching the Shinra simulator and found something amazing. Ta-da! The Soldier P0 class training program. P0 class? Never heard of it. Neither had I. I think they're soldiers from way back or something. Anyway, I created a special program based on theirs. I call it Jesse's Amazing Very Special Battle Simulator. I don't need it, but thanks. Aw, don't say that. You'll get a reward if you win. A reward, huh? <laughs> Interested now, are we? Feel free to use it whenever you want. Well, rest up. We have a big day tomorrow. Cloud and the others leave Seventh Heaven at daybreak and ride the train to Avalanche's next destination. Slipping beneath Shinra's radar, he rendezvous with the other three who went ahead to secure his route. Their next mission? Bombing Makul Reactor 5. We've got this covered. Come on, let's do this. Papa. This sword. This is... Sephiroth's sword. Sephiroth did this, didn't he? Sephiroth. Soldier. Mako reactors. Shinra. All of them. I hate them all! Damn, man. Get a hold of yourself. Are you okay? Tifa. You don't look so hot, Cloud. I'm fine.
fine. That should do it. Let's get out of here. Exit. Too easy. What the Shinra scum? Shit. What the hell's going on? This was a setup. Precisely. Welcome. President Shinra. Why is the president here? Hmm. So you all must be from that group. What was it? Evelyn! Don't you dare forget it! It's been a while, sir. A while, you say? Ah, yes. The former soldier now throwing his lot in with Avalanche. Your eyes do shine of Mako. Tell me, traitor, what is your name? Cloud. Well, Cloud, you'll have to forgive me. But I simply cannot commit every soldier's name to memory. Unless you become another Sephiroth. Sephiroth? Yes, he was a truly brilliant soldier. Perhaps too brilliant. Don't give a damn about none of that. This place is about to blow. And you got the best seats in the house, Mr. President. Those fireworks are a small price to pay to eradicate vermin like yourselves. Who you calling vermin, old man? This coming from a parasite sucking the planet dry. Shinra the vermin for killing the planet. Guess that makes you King Vermin. So shut up, jackass. Barking dogs seldom bite, as the saying goes. You're beginning to bore me. I'm a very busy man, so if you'll excuse me, I have a dinner I must attend. Dinner? Don't give me that. I ain't even started with you yet. But I've made arrangements for a playmate for you all. Meet the Advanced Weaponry Division's latest mechanized unit, the Air Buster. Mechanized unit? The data you provide us from this fight will be invaluable going forward. Now then, if you'll excuse me. Wait, President! Look over there! What the hell is this? Come on, let's get rid of this thing! No holding back. That's that. Cloud! Yeah! Take this! Is it dead? It will be. Yeah! <sighs> Cloud! That 
rusty bucket of bolts. You two go on ahead. Let's go, Tifa. No! There must be something we can do. If we don't, then Cloud. If we don't get going, we're all toast. He's right. Go on, Tifa. Cloud! You better not die! You can't die! There's still so much I want to tell you! I know. You're going to be okay, right? You worry about yourselves. I'll be fine. Take care of Tifa. All right. Sorry about everything. Stop talking like this is the end. Right. See you back at Sector 7. Ah, let me go! Cloud! <laughs> You all right? Can you hear me? Yeah. Back then, I only got scraped knees. What do you mean by, back then? What about now? Can you get up? What do you mean by back then? What about now? Don't worry about me. Worry about yourself for now. Move something. Anything. I'll try. Oh! It moved! How about that? Take it slow now. Little by little. Hello! Hello! I know. Hey. Who are you? Hello! Hello! You okay? Yeah. Where am I? This is a church in the Sector 5 slums. You just fell from above. You really gave me a scare. I came crashing down. The roof and the flower bed must have broken your fall. You're lucky. Flower bed? Is this yours? Sorry about that. That's alright. The flowers here are quite resilient. Because this is a sacred place. Sacred? They say grass and flowers won't grow in Midgar, but for some reason, these have no trouble blooming here. I love it here. So, we meet again. Again? Don't you remember me? Yeah. I remember. Oh, the flower girl. Oh, I'm so happy. Thanks for buying one of my flowers. Say, I feel like talking. Do you feel up to it? After all, here we are meeting again. I don't mind. Wait here. I've got to check my flowers. It'll just be a minute. I thought you wanted to talk. done. Oh, now that you mention it, we don't know each other's names, do we? 
I am Aerith, the flower girl. Nice to meet you. The name's Cloud. Me? I do a little bit of everything. Oh, a jack of all trades. Yeah, I do whatever's needed. <laughs> What's so funny? What are you laughing at? Sorry, I just... Oh! I see you have some materia. I've got one too. Nowadays you can find materia anywhere. But mine is special. It's good for absolutely nothing. Good for nothing? You just don't know how to use it. No, I do. But I don't mind if it doesn't do anything. I feel safe just having it. It was my mother's. Company, huh? Ugh. Talk about bad timing. Who are you? Cloud! Don't mind him. Say, Cloud, have you ever been a bodyguard? You can do anything, right? Yeah, that's right. Then, get me out of here. Take me home. Okay, but it'll cost you. Okay then, let's see. How about if I go out with you once? Sure. Fine. I don't know who you are, but... I don't? Mm -hmm. That's right. That uniform. Hey, sis. This one's a little weird. Shut up, Shinra scum! Reno, want him taken out? I don't care. Just grab her. Let's go. Come on. Here it comes. Time to get serious. That's it. This one's for you. Ready? Let's finish this. Means more magic. No way. Job's a job. You'll ruin the flowers! Cloud, the exit is back there. Let's go. Did you see that guy's eyes? Oh. You just stepped on him You're yourself. gonna catch holy You're hell! Ruined. <laughs>